for stopping by my channel um, today. I wanted to do a little review on, ooh, sorry, I'm playing with things down here, I'm opening them, um, on some drugstore, drug store, I mean Walmart, Target, Ulta, because Ulta doesn't just sell the higher end um, brands and more expensive brands, they also sell the same stuff that you would find at Target and um, Walmart, Walgreens, I'm trying to think of what else, Rite Aid. I don't, I don't know what actual drug stores are still out there except Walgreens. Um, anyway, so I purchased these products on Ulta because I am part of their rewards program. So I like it that if I'm going to buy something anyway that I get rewarded for it. That excites me. Um, because then I like it when I do want to purchase something, I get points off. So I, ra or I, I, I earn points and then they give me money off of my purchase so I can redeem those points. So I like that. So anyway, I wanted to go over some of these products. I'll swatch some of the um, eyeshadow palettes for you. Um, overall, I am impressed. Uh, that's what I'm wearing on my face. And I used all NYX and Essence products. I will say the Essence products, I saw them at Target and I was a little put off. So I'm, I'm looking at them and I'm like, ooh, these look really nice. And I happened to pick up one of their um, eyeshadow palettes like this and I'm looking at it and I'm like, why? Why does this look so weird? So I'm looking at it, I'm checking it out and I'm reading in the back and something just didn't, something just wasn't clicking with me and I'm like, this looks funny. So I pick up another one because it had different colors. Um, this is the All About Nudes, the nudes one, but I think, I'm pretty sure there were other colors. One was like more of a green and gold in, in the palette. So I'm looking at them and I'm like, what is weird? And I was like, I know what it is. They don't have plastic like sealing the, the actual package. So there was no plastic around any of this stuff because I even picked up this uh, mascara and I was like well that's odd there's no like plastic seal around it so I go back to the eyeshadow thing that I was looking at and I picked up a different one like from the back of the display yeah I'm that person I go to the back and I'm like I'll pick this one up and I'm looking at it and I'm like okay there's really something wrong with this like what and I turn it and a reflection, like the, the way the lights in Target were really bright and the way I just turned the palette, I was like, that looks like a fingerprint in the palette. And then I realized, yes, somebody had, I can't open it. Somebody had opened the palette and stuck their finger in the darker color. I don't know whether to swatch it or just touching it being stupid. I don't know. And I was like, ugh. So I put everything back. Like I had all these products and then I was like, no, I'm not, I'm not doing that. That's, that's gross. Somebody's been in here touching them and then, you know, I'm, I'm a bit of a, a freak, I guess you could say. I don't know. I don't know what you call that. I, maybe it is a freak. I don't know. Maybe it's just being whatever, but I'm not going to purchase something that somebody has been touching. And I don't know. What if somebody picked up the mascara and was like, hey, let me try this out and then put it back together and put it back on the shelf. So now I don't know. So Anyway, that's like my 10 minute soapbox about Essence products. But I was upset because I really wanted to try them because they're really affordable. I want to say, let's see, I want to say that this Essence palette, this little eyeshadow palette, $5. Like, come on. And they're cruel, they're cruelty free products. So. I was excited about that and I'm like I really want to try this let's see let's see yeah five five forty nine for this five dollars and forty nine cents and you get two four six eight eight colors um, so anyway with that I guess I'll jump right into it so I got this essence let's see I'm trying to think of where I guess I'll put them on the back of my hand so I'll go down that top row first and swatch the colors for you. Oh, they're super like soft and creamy. Creamy. Like once you get in there and you're like moving around, it's it's like super soft. It's 
So that, well that didn't work out. That was silly. Um, yeah, that was dumb on my part. <laughs> so anyway, um, that is the top row. Let me just turn it like that. How about this? Do do do. Yes, I, I know guys, I'm special. Like I wasn't thinking. So that's the color under each color. Um, it's not bad. They're really nice. And like I said, five, five, um, 49. That's what Ulta, Ulta has it as. So let's see. Let's do. Oh my gosh, at this rate with me being so special, this video is gonna be like forever long, I'm sorry. So I'm gonna do the second row. I mean, they're definitely light colors for being nudes. Um, me, because I'm, I'm, I mean, my I'm lighter skin tone, but these would probably show up really well on um, darker skin tones. So there's the bottom row swatched. Can you see that? So that bottom row, the, the, the colors are definitely a bit lighter than that, that top row. But it's definitely a nice formula. And again, $5.49. And like I say, they're cruelty free. Um, I want to say these. Uh, New York, made in Italy. Hmm, but it says it contains Carmine. Let's see what that is, because I don't know. Ow, oh, Carmine, a vivid crimson color. A pigment made from cochineal. What is that? I don't know what that is, but whatever. Um, so I got this. The Princess Lash. I'm wearing it now. I really, I really enjoyed it. It went on nice. I don't have any lashes on. These are mine. It went on nice. Um... This was, I should have had these all written out in front of me. See, hindsight, just one eight twenty. Four dollars four ninety nine for this. So that's good. So that, um, I used the NYX setting spray and I think, I think it did well. I mean, I did my, um, makeup earlier, uh, couple hours ago, four hours ago, because um, I, I filmed that tutorial, so that video will be up as well. Um, I got this Essence lipstick in Cool Nude, and that is what I'm wearing on my lips right now. So that's definitely a pretty color, and I think these this was like $2.99, but I got it on sale. It was like buy one, get one 50% off. So literally three, let's say three, three, so three, four, four fifty for two lipsticks. So I got that color and then I got porcelain doll, which is a really light nude color. So I got those two and I like it so far, mm, not sticky. And I had this on earlier, like I said, I did my makeup this morning and then it lasted quite a while and then I ate and then I was, you know, drinking or whatever and it did pretty good. And then I got this lip gloss that I have over the Cool Nude. The Essence Triple X Shine gloss in nude kiss and that's it right here on the top you see that i mean it just adds like a nice um sheen to your lips let me wipe that off okay and then today i used the nyx 
stay matte but not flat and it applied well uh, actually let me show you this one first I used the primer the NYX Angel Veil primer tiny twinge of a smell but not as bad as um, you know some that I have like I think I mentioned my Too Faced one that I have the poreless primer for I think it was sensitive skin oh just the 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 silicone smell of that and then the Smashbox photo finish primer like the smells in those two I don't do, <laughs> I don't do well with them I think I have an olfactory issue my my sniffer is like sensitive to things so anyway I used the Angel Veil uh, primer and then I put this over top and again and my face it, it feels um, it feels smooth it feels nice it doesn't feel sticky or cakey or gross I did get this the essence um, I love stage eyeshadow base but I have I didn't use it today hmm. looks like it's a, a thick coverage yeah but I used the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Concealer. Oh, let me tell you how much the um, the NYX stuff was. I'll link every and I'll link everything below for you. Um, the Stay Matte but Not Flat, seven fifty. So I paid seven fifty for this primer. Um, right now it says buy one get one fifty get one at fifty percent off. So that's NYX products on Ulta. Um, same thing with the primer. I think it's all NYX products right now on Ulta are buy one get one at fifty percent off. Add two items to qualify. So again, I would rather just order stuff from them. I did pay fifteen dollars for this, so that was fifteen ninety nine. But again, you buy one thing, you get something else, you get it 50% off. So you can't go wrong there. You're getting money off. And then, um, like I said, with the Essence products, because they aren't packaged with um, seals around them, I feel better just ordering them from a warehouse because I can't see somebody going through a warehouse and touching things and testing them. I hope not. I did use the concealer. It is a bit watery I guess it's it's thin so I had to apply a couple coats but it's not creasing I mean I get I don't know I got wrinkly eyes I don't know what to tell you there underneath but the the makeup itself is not creasing and I actually use that on my eyelid and then I set everything with the NYX HD finishing powder So let's see, translucent, 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 $9.99. So that was $9.99 and I'm sure I got 50% off of one of these. I used the NYX Ombre Blush. Look how pretty that is. Oh, that was a little plastic insert. So it's a nice um, peachy apricot -y Yeah, you're gonna remember that apricot-ish color. So that was that. And then I also got, so that was $9.99 for, for the blush. And I mean, that's a big pan. That's eight grams. I can't open these packages. I'm, this is the one I used today. It's mauve, mauve, however you wanna say it. Tomato, tomato. I know some people are like, that's not how you say it. So, it's a light mauve color. You know, and you can build it up. You see that? So, I would, I mean, I'm super impressed with these. They're super affordable products. 
and I actually enjoyed them. Like I would use, I think these as my everyday products. I uh, showed you the lipsticks, showed you that. I used these on my eye, these, I used this on my eyebrows. What's it say? Make Me Brow by Essence. And it's got a little, um, just a little wand in there to apply. I definitely started in the middle because there was more product on there. I started in the middle and then worked towards the end. And then by the time I did all of this portion, then I went in and did the front. So I wouldn't end up with too much product there in the front. But it, it set it. It gave it color and it, it set it. So Essence. So that was $2.99. $2.99 for that. And I mean, it's a nice size tube. Eyebrow gel mascara. So that was that. I used the Essence Pure Nude Highlight. And that's what I have on. You see that? It's right here in the middle from, there we go, here to here. That's the highlight. That was four forty nine, and it says special free gift with purchase. Now I wonder what you get. Click for offer details. Oh, if you online only though, free I love extreme crazy volume mascara with any ten dollar essence purchase. Okay through tomorrow or while supplies last. See, Ulta, again, I feel like they're constantly giving um, promotions. They're giving you reasons to want to, to shop with them, you know. If you're gonna spend the money, why not get some free things or get you build up your rewards points and get money off? Because you can use money off on any purchase. That's the good thing about it. So if I went in there and bought, let's say I wanted to buy a $50 palette, um, like from a higher end product, I would be able to use those rewards points for money off of that palette. Whereas a lot of the things don't, um, you can't use coupons. And then I got the Essence um, Kajal eye pencil, and I used that today for my for my eyeliner. It's just your your regular black eye pencil. And then. I did get the NYX Professional Makeup um, Faux White Linen Pencil. And this is more of a, um, what's the word, kind of like the, not gel, but that's what I want to say. Made in France. I would drop it. It's good. It's good. I didn't break anything. So that's like the creamier, creamier pencil, not like the um, like the actual pencil. And then I used oh those two. What were they? Oh, that's what it is, the gel pencil liner. Uh, I don't think I paid $11.99 for that one though. $7.99 I paid for that one. And then the Essence. The Essence eye pencil. $2.99, $2.99, $2.99 I paid for this one and then $7.99 and like I said, it, I got everything during a sale so I'm sure I got money off somewhere. The, obviously, the more expensive product that you pay, you pay for that and then the next least expensive, they take the 50% off. So then I got the NYX um, bronzer and I have that on to do. So I can burn my skin. $8.99. So that's the color. I 
and it, I mean, I think it, it went on well, so. There's the color, so that's nice. Um, one more thing, one more thing, and then I will be done. I'm sorry if this video ended up being longer than anticipated. The NYX Lid Lingerie Shadow Palette. $9.99 for this one and you get six colors. Um, I did use, I used this one today and that's all I used for my eyes. So. I'm just gonna try to swatch this from the bottom. Not from the bottom, now we heal. Sorry. Me. Run out of fingers. Ooh, can I make it? Ah! I don't know. I don't know. This might look silly. So there's the colors. So the top one on my hand is this one. And then it goes like that. So there's that darker brown at the top. And then that pinkish shade in between the two browns and then the brown and then like that burnt terracotta orangish and then that lilac S color is here and then that lighter color, this one is at the bottom. Oops, sorry. So that's that and like I said, that's what I used on my eyes today. Um, and I did the tutorial on that, so if you would like to watch that video, that will be up as well. So, well, guys, I hope you found that informative. Um, that's the first time I've gone ham on these two products, buying so much of just the NYX and the Essence. So, I hope that helps you out if you're in the market for some cruelty free products that you wanted to try but you're kind of not sure of um that way you can see and again i mean good prices and you know a lot of people don't like to shop online you can go to walgreens i don't know if they run the same sales like if that's a company thing i'm sure the companies i'm sure they have sales at walgreens i know um Walgreens they used to ha they have reward points as well so when you purchase so many things in there you end up with points and can take them off so by all means you go wherever you want to go you do what you need to do I'm not promoting Ulta I don't get sent any products these are all my own opinions I just like makeup it is my hobby I enjoy doing it it's an outlet for me I have fun with it so I am enjoying doing this I'm having fun I'm glad I have the time to do it and I'm just hoping that I can help some of you because when I first started getting into makeup I was like I don't know what to buy I don't know what's good I don't even know what I'm looking for so I don't know just thought I'd pass it along getting some good products cruelty free affordable so um, again, constructive criticism, leave your comments below. If you're here to be negative or nasty, I don't want to hear it because I'm not wasting your time, so don't waste mine. That is all. So, I hope you enjoy the rest of whatever day this is for you. If it's morning, if it's night, if it's whatever, and enjoy the rest of it. And thanks for stopping by.